Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jules. Today I'm going to be trying out the new Gucci powder, um, specifically the Poudre de Beauté, I believe is how you say it, but this is the Beauty Powder, and this specific powder is not new, but recently this uh, became available at Sephora, and so I wanted to go ahead and pick it up. The reason why I like to wait for items to come to Sephora is I have a really hard time matching my skin to the different shades that are online. The shades online are very deceiving and they may not actually be what they appear to be. And so when items become available at Sephora, I know that I can exchange if it's not the correct shade. Uh, I know with Gucci, if you buy directly from their website and try a product, you can't return it. So you're kind of stuck with a product that you can't use um, and especially for something like Gucci, you want to be able to get your right shade. So that is why I wait till most items come to Sephora. So now that it is available at Sephora, I wanted to go ahead and pick it up and try it out for myself. So if you're interested in seeing a demo of this product, hearing all about the product, and hearing what my thoughts are after trying out the product, go ahead and keep on watching. All right, guys, I'm going to be reading directly from Gucci's website. First off, let me show you the packaging. Here is the outer packaging. This is very standard for Gucci products. This is how they all have looked so far from, from all the ones that I have tried. Here is the actual product. Beautiful, beautiful luxe packaging. This is very similar to the bronzer. This is just a different color right here. I love this blush color. And then here's the back side. I did pick up the shade 10, and this is what the shade looks like. I will go ahead and swatch this for you in case that helps you. So there it is swatched on me. All right, let's get into the details of this product. This is a buildable face powder that creates a unified complexion with a natural finish. This also offers a lightweight and visibly smooth texture. So I was very surprised that they have 14 shades available on Gucci's website. I will go to Sephora and see how many they have available there. But here they have, they have 17 shades, which is awesome. There is a variety of shades in the powders, and I think that is so great. These powders retail for $62. So that covers the details of the powder. Let's go ahead and get into the demo and I'll be back with my thoughts. Okay, so I did just look at Sephora's website and unfortunately they only have 11 shades. So Gucci's gonna have the full line of products and Sephora only has a part of them. Um, from looking at it, it still looks like a pretty decent shade range on Sephora's website. All right guys, I'm opening this up for the very first time. Look at this beautiful box. This is typical for all Gucci products. And then when you open it up, it comes in this is posh little duster and it has Gucci embossed into it. And then here is the compact. It's this beautiful tan shade that all, most all Gucci products have this. I know the mascara has this similar color. And then you have the gold backing. So just beautiful and luxurious. Here is the powder. And then underneath you have a little poof, which I probably will never use. The shade that I have is number 10. I did shade match this to myself online, so we'll see how good that this is. But this does look pretty similar to most of my powders that I have. I'm going to go in with my BK Beauty 102 brush. This is the all over powder brush and this is clean. So at this point in my routine, I've done everything up until powdering. I have gone ahead and set the center of my face like I normally do. And then I usually save my powder for the outer perimeters of my face. So I'm just gonna go right on in. Just gonna pick up some on one side. Not much kick up. And this has that beautiful Gucci fragrance. So there it is on my brush. And then 
going to go ahead and apply this to the outer perimeters of my face. I'm going to pick up just a little bit more. goes on very smoothly and I feel like it just added to the foundation that I have on and set it beautifully. It doesn't look heavy or anything like that. It just set it beautifully and I think the color is perfect. This is what it looks like close up. So, do I love this product? I love it. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, I love luxury products and I love them even more when they are beautiful on the skin. Um, I think that it went on so smoothly. Now, I will have to give you an update as far as wear time on this. Um, having worn it for an extended period of time, I'll have to tell you if anything changed. But so far right now, everything looks so smooth. And I think the description was very accurate on Gucci's website in that it is a light, airy finish. So looking back on Gucci's website, it does say that it has a lightweight, visibly smooth texture. And I will have to say, I agree with that. It looks so smooth on the skin. I think that the color match was spot on. Thankfully, I have such a hard time matching shades online. But yeah, I love this powder and it's definitely going to be a keeper. So I'm interested to know if you had seen this powder and were interested in getting it. Do you already have it? Let me know what your thoughts are down in the comments below. Let me know what you think of the look. I'm also filming this in conjunction with another video. Um, Matt came out with a new black cherry collection and so that's why the look is familiar. Um, the products that I used on my face are all from my shop my stash for the month if you're interested in seeing what those products are and checking that video out i will go ahead and link it for you right here if you enjoy videos like these don't forget to go ahead and hit that subscribe button on your way out and as always i love you guys be blessed and i will see you in the very next one bye